Hey everyone, this is Brian from Provision Studios and I'm doing a quick camera test of the G50 running into the Atomos Ninja Flame. I am recording uh, straight out of the HDMI port on the G50 into the uh, HDMI input of the, uh, of the Flame. We are running uh, the, a, a clean out a clean signal out of the G50 which is uh, a 10 bit 422 signal going into the flame at a uh, 1080p 24 frames per second resolution so um, let's see I, I so, you're, all right, so everything is what I just said is actually what is being recorded so that's all accurate uh, that's good to go let me see what else I got here I've got a little over nine hours of recording time on this SSD drive it's a 512 gig SSD drive um, I formatted one of my uh, single terabyte um, HDDs that I had laying around uh, I was using this as a studio backup for my clients but I, uh, I, I back up in triplicate. So uh, this was one of my three backups. Uh, so what, what, what I'm doing in, in, to replace that is I'm now using a new service called Backblaze, which constantly backs up my studio computer. Um, anytime I'm online, uh, the uh, Backblaze starts working. Uh, for looking for any uh, file changes um, it will not upload or back up any files that are the same so it's only looking for changes um, and it does that automatically so I don't have to do anything other than be working on my computer and as long as it's online it's backing up to uh, Backblaze's website um, I think it's six dollars a month uh, for unlimited unlimited backup uh, of storage as long as um, I pay my bill every month they're gonna keep backing up my my studio computer on my studio computer I have the system drive I have the SSD uh, drive that I record to I have my RAID array that I back up to and then I have another backup drive that is not connected to it yet I back that up manually on my home network so that's where I get my three back and then the back blaze so that's where I get my three backups as well as the original uh, uh, files so um so anyway so th since I got back blaze I really didn't need I, I don't I, I don't need four four versions so um this is going to be I'm going to get a, a the uh, the caddy set you can get either four or five of the uh, the caddies that you put your your uh, two and a half inch drives in so um, I'll be getting some uh, caddies in so I'll have the uh, one terabyte H HDD that came with the flame when I bought it I also will have this one terabyte HDD that I uh, just formatted and then I've got the SD SSD that I bought the weekend before this arrived knowing that this was coming um, so um, as I said in an earlier video uh, you do not need SSD to record 1080p uh, on the flame um, the uh, uh, SSD is for uh, 4k video and I can't run 4k out of uh, the G50, which is the camera I'm going to be using to record into the flame. Um, I didn't know that when I bought the SSD, but hey, it's a faster drive. It's got faster read and write speeds. Uh, even though I, I can't get the 4K out of the camera, which is what the flame suggests that you use SSD for uh, on 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 its on 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 its on the device. I'm not worried about the overkill that. That the, that the SSD provides in this case 
so see how the batteries are doing um my uh f770 is draining pretty fast so um i'm keeping my eye on that the dc uh power brick it definitely introduces uh noise into the audio path when you when you plug it in so um it'd be great to use it um but um i don't like the fact that it introduces noise into the audio now that's fine it doesn't matter if i'm using an off uh like 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 an external audio recorder which is what i plan to do um but for the purposes of this video and in studio videos um or i'm i'm doing um talking head vlog style i'm not i, I don't know that I, i'm, I'm going to be always miking up uh with a lapel i'm probably going to use it uh you know my my road video might go that i've got um on top of the, the G50 right now, um, I could use uh, boom mics. You know that would be positioned right above above my head. I've got plenty of studio mics that I could use for that purpose. So I really don't need to, to, to bust out the lapel and and the wireless and all that and 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 do all of that audio recording for this type of thing. When I can get a really good audio signal off of the road, so. Um, and that's the only reason why I'm doing this is because I'm satisfied with the audio signal I am getting off of uh, the Rode mic. So, um, again, uh, uh, I just, I, I, I wanted to get some footage of the, um, the, the flame shooting what the G50 was capturing so I could compare them side by side as I'm learning more about the ideal settings for the flame. So, um. I want to look at what I got. I want to see how it compares, and I want to go from there. Uh, I'm shooting at ProRes 422 on the uh, the flame. I can shoot ProRes HQ, but the file sizes are really large, and I don't know that I'll do that for anything other than client work or my own music videos that I, I might do for either my band or um, for for you know my my day of awakening a personal project. Um, this kind of thing, uh, ProRes 422 is way overkill. But again, I, I, I want to make sure that when I go out and use this in the field, I've run it through its paces, and I know, you know what, 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 I, what I'm looking at, what's it going to look like when I get it back in, uh, in the studio. So um, the next step is to get this in the G50 outside. I still haven't had a chance to do it. The weather's been kind of spotty here in my area all week. Actually, the last couple weeks. Um, so as soon as I get a good day, probably, maybe this weekend, I'm going to get my rig set up and get this outside, um, and shoot some footage with it. Um, I got to the point in the manual where, where it was talking about time lapse re recorded on the, uh, the flame. So, um, that might be something that I look at. So you record your video regular on the camera, and then you do you create the time lapse, or or you allow the flame to create the time lapse off of the signal that you're feeding into it. So I don't know how all that works yet. I just I, again I was just that's the part I was at in the manual. So I'm almost done with the manual all the way through. Um, I've 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 actually learned quite a bit by reading the manual. So um, uh, that that's all good to go. Uh. All right, let me go and um, get this, uh, this, uh, the, these files pulled off of here so I can get them on my computer and start taking a look at some of this footage. Hopefully I can get this loaded up before the weekend. I've already got the unboxing video uh, working. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to edit it right now, but I, I got a lot of clips. I've got the G50, I had the X53 on it, and I was recording portions of it. Uh, on the flame so I've got three camera angles to uh, edit as well as trying to make the uh, the ProRes 422 footage uh, edit it on, on, on my computer it's I'm, I'm, I'm noticing that there's a little bit of lag there so I'm having to create optimized media and all that so anyway 
Um, I'm working on it. I'm, I'm trying to figure everything out, and uh, hopefully, I have this all the all, all these files uh, in the can on a computer, edited and uploaded by the weekend. So, um, any question, comments, questions, and in, in or comments, leave them in the uh, section below. If you'd like to email me. Always feel free to email me at bbucka22 at gmail.com. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, if you if you want to subscribe to my channel, uh, it would be great if you'd hit the notification icon. That way you get a uh, notification uh, anytime I upload new videos. And if uh, you would be so inclined to share the video with any friends that you think might benefit from what I'm showing here, that would be very much appreciated. Thank you very much, and I hope you have a great rest of the day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye now.